Deep inside the Earth, our planet is made of four different layers. Geologists believe as the Earth formed, heavier materials sank to the middle of the Earth and lighter materials stayed on the outside. The two deepest layers of the Earth are called the core. The inner core is a solid, dense, and heavy layer made up of iron and nickel. It is extremely hot and can reach temperatures of up to 10,000 Fahrenheit. The outer core is a liquid layer made up of molten iron and nickel. It is so hot in the outer core that the metals in this layer have turned into liquid. The third layer is called the mantle. The mantle is the thickest layer. It is approximately 1,802 miles thick. It is made of solid magma, which is made of molten rock and minerals. The final layer of the Earth is called the crust. This is a very thin layer. It is only about 20 to 50 miles thick. It's not a single smooth layer, but instead broken into many different pieces called plates. These pieces can rub against each other, causing friction and pressure. How are volcanoes formed? The intense heat and friction created in the different layers cause a constant change in the Earth. The crust of the Earth is broken into different pieces. The gaps where these different pieces meet is where magma and gases escape. The high heat and pressure cause the magma to rise to the surface of the Earth. The places where magma heats up and rises are called hot spots. When there is a gap or a weak spot in the crust of the Earth, magma can break through to the surface and erupt. This eruption can be explosive or a single small stream. When magma breaks through to the surface, it is then called lava. Cinders, ash, and other gases also escape during this eruption. As lava cools, it builds up creating the steep slopes of mountains we associate with volcanoes. Millions of people around the world live close to active volcanoes that can erupt at any time. Many of the world's volcanoes are located in a string around the Pacific Ocean called the Ring of Fire. A large part of the danger of volcanic eruption is the lava that spews from the top of the mountain. However, the volcanic ash and gases that explode from the volcano can cause severe health problems and harm. Volcanic ash can travel hundreds of miles and contaminate water supplies, damage machinery, reduce visibility, and make it hard to breathe. When volcanoes erupt, many materials are also ejected. These minerals can help plants and can make the soil surrounding the volcanoes very rich and fertile. Fun facts about volcanoes. The name volcano is derived from Vulcan, who was the Roman god of fire. While they can be destructive, Volcanoes can also be very beneficial for people. They can cool the atmosphere, provide fertile soil, and create precious gems and minerals. Earth isn't the only planet in our galaxy with volcanoes. In fact, the tallest volcano in our solar system is Olympus Mons on Mars. Five Famous Volcanoes Mount Etna, situated on the island of Sicily, it is one of the world's most active volcanoes. 
Krakatoa. The eruption of this volcano in 1883 was one of the biggest ever and was heard over 3,000 miles away. Mount Vesuvius. This active Italian volcano destroyed the cities of Pompeii and Herculaneum in 79 AD. Ea Fiat Laioco. Situated in Iceland and meaning Glacier of the Mountains of the Islands, its eruption in 2010 significantly disrupted air travel. Mount St. Helens. The eruption in 1980 was the worst in the history of the United States. That's all for now. For more information and resources related to volcanoes, head to twinkle.com.